Hello, I'm Stuart from Lartbook, and today I will be reviewing the GreensCon, also known as UTAD, I don't know why, a camping kit designed for two to three people. Okay, as I said before, this is the UTAD uh, lightweight camping cut cookware. Uh, the model is the T224, hopefully it never rises up and tries to kill all of humanity. Uh, it's made of uh, aluminium alloy, weighs 700 grams, so it's quite light. Uh, they've got all the dimensions there as well, about the frying pan, uh, the medium pot and the kettle. I'm sure you can see that. Uh, so let's take it out of the box. I've already had a quick look at it and actually I'm quite happy with it. So there you go, it comes in a lovely little bag to put it all in. Uh, it really doesn't weigh much at all. Now let's take it out and have a little look. So lid, some lids, pot, etc. So let's get rid of that bag for a moment and let's have a little look. So you've got uh, a frying pan, okay? Frying pan comes with handles that lock out with plastic on the end so you don't burn your hand. That's quite nice. Uh, it does come with what I can only be uh, describe as the most pathetic bowls on the planet. But hey, I'm sure they'll have some use uh, putting Smarties or M&Ms or nuts or whatever. Yes, <laughs> it's not big enough. Uh, it does come uh, with a ladle. Again, not quite sure what you do with that, but all right. Uh, it comes with a wooden spoon for stirring. What else would you do with a wooden spoon? Uh, it does come with a sponge so you can clean stuff afterward, which I think is actually quite a nice touch, to be honest with you. Uh, here's the kettle, and there's the lid for the kettle. Uh, it's The kettle itself is incredibly lightweight. I'll let you know that now. Um, the pot probably weighs the most, but again, it does have these folding handles, yeah, and it's a decent size. Now, they say that this is a cookware set for two to three people. I'd say more like two. Um, I wouldn't say, you know, third person if they happen to be a very small child that doesn't eat or drink a lot. Um, so there we go. Let's take this out of here. So it's got a nice lid to go on the pan. Yeah. With the ladle. The three useless bowls. Uh, a wooden spoon. Frying pan. And a sponge. But I think the key question is, can it boil that essential cup of tea or coffee in the morning? So, I've brought back out the gas stove, which I reviewed in uh, an earlier video, uh, just for this demonstration, and we'll see uh, how well everything works together. Oh, I see steam. Yep, I definitely see steam. <laughs> I'd say that's done. Now, of course, the ultimate test. Um, how much will it fill up the lap bug mug? Oh Lord, all the way and some to spare. Um, so yeah, it actually holds uh, quite a bit. <laughs> so there we go. Nice beverage, ready to rock. So in conclusion then, uh, the camp cooking set is very good. It's lightweight, it's sturdy, 
It holds way more than you actually think, and it also comes with some neat little optional extras, although I'm still not quite sure what I would do with those bowls, apart from put nuts in them or the tops of beer bottles. But apart from that, everything else is, uh, is usable and functional. So if you have been watching, thank you very much. Do not forget to click the subscribe and to hit that little bell to see when more things come out. So for now, it's goodbye from me. Hello, I'm Stuart from LARPbook and today I will be reviewing the Greens Con, also known as UTAD, don't know why, uh, camping cut quick, cut complete.